Hello everyone, uh, I had uh, several requests on uh, this channel to tell people how to play all of the games I've been playing, how to play Witcher 3, how to play Destiny 2, how to play some of the most popular games nowadays, uh, and how do I do it with a MacBook. Uh, well, it's a quite an easy system to install uh, the system is called NVIDIA GeForce Now so the first thing you should do in order to use this system is to install NVIDIA GeForce Now so just write it on Google and then you will have the, the one of the, the, the website that you want so www.nvidia.com and you should have this folder here download. If you don't have this folder here, you should have it inside the website. So uh, when you see this website, you just click on it. And as you can see, we're gonna put rest of Europe. And now, and now, as you can see, we have all of the most popular games Nowadays, in 2021, you have Destiny 2, Cyberpunk, Assassin's Creed, Fortnite, Apex Legends. Of course, you have many more, you have Witcher 3 and others. As you can see from the website, there are many platforms in, uh, you can use to play these games. But now, uh, let's go here to the top right corner and install and click Play Now. And there are two memberships, uh, the free membership and the priority one. Uh, with a free membership, you have standard access, doesn't cost you anything. And every hour, you have to disconnect from the game and connect again. So if you pay uh, 10 euros uh, per month, or I think it's around 100 euros per year, if you want to, then you have uh, you enter the game almost immediately that's what this means priority access to gaming servers you have extended se session length which means that you can play for hours and hours and hours and you have rtx um, but we're going to choose the free version so click join and then it will ask you and then it will ask you to include all of your information like name email password etc etc it will send you an email to the email that you included uh, and you must confirm that email and then you, your account should be finished should be accepted after this, you will have to download uh, the macOS version of this program. So click download. It will give you a DMG file. It only takes up 212 megabytes. Click on it, drag this icon to the applications folder, copying and now you should have, here it is, you should have this icon and now when you click on it, open and here it is I'm inside my my account this test account that I created for this video it's not my actual account and you have all these games you can play but you must remember that some games are completely free 
For example, Apex Legends is completely free. Uh, the one we will try to play just to show you, Counter-Strike Global Offensive, is also completely free. But there are games uh, such as uh, Witcher 3 that you have to pay to buy the game. So you just buy the game once and then you can play it whenever you want. Or, uh, for example, uh, th there are other games that, uh, that you need to pay. You need to buy the game. But once you buy the game, then you can play it whenever you want to. So, um, why is this a good system? Well, first of all, an important aspect is that uh, it doesn't take up almost any space in your MacBook. Uh, because, again, you are not installing the game on your MacBook, you're installing the game on a, on a server, uh, so they are the ones that have uh, uh, that uh, that will take up that space. Let's say. Uh, so what you're getting is you're receiving the image basically, uh, which is good in some access because you save up on uh, storage. Uh, and uh, let me remind you, a game like Witcher 3 has uh, around 80 gigabytes. Uh, so it's quite a heavy game and in this case it I don't know exactly how much it takes up in your space, but it's almost nothing um, Or for example a game like cyberpunk it will also take you many gigabytes uh, I don't know exactly uh, but uh, probably it's a very heavy game, but uh, In this case in if you play it through the Nvidia GeForce now it will take I don't know how much but uh, not a lot um, and that's it, so um, I will try to play one game, I'll try to play Counter-Strike just to show you uh, that it actually works. So rem the, remember that the only thing you have to do is go to NVIDIA GeForce Now, you say that you want to participate, you click, uh, you put in all your data, name, email, age, date of birth, etc. If you will receive an email in the email address that you provided and you have to click that email to authorize the to say that you are really the owner of the email then you must uh, have a steam account as well uh, and then when you uh, you also must download the the icon that we install that we already installed and uh, then you can go to any game just remember that there are some games that if it shows you that you cannot play it uh, it will mean that you have to buy the the, the game first so um, what I will sh I will show you counter strike global offensive because you don't have to buy the game it's free uh, but remember that there are some games that you need to pay uh, and you pay just to buy the game uh, you don't you don't pay a monthly fee or anything you just play to buy the game and uh, if you have the free version of Nvidia GeForce Now remember that uh, as you will see we'll try to play Counter-Strike and it will tell me you see that there are gamers ahead of me which are 126 Usually you will have to wait around two minutes, uh, something like this. Uh, but if you want to skip this line, you have to pay, you have to have the, um, the best version of NVIDIA GeForce Now, which means that you have to pay either per month or per year. I, I chose the yearly account uh, and it's around 100 euros and you have better graphics and it helps in a lot of ways uh, but still usually you only have to wait one or two minutes it's usually not that much not that long so uh, after you've done waiting for these people to stop playing then you will connect to the game so let's wait a little let's wait these one or two minutes and then we'll start playing as you can see now it the game opened and now it's asking me for my steam account i have to include it 
and then afterwards it will go in the game. As you can see it's going in. And as you can see we are in the game. And now we'll enter a random game. And here we are now playing Counter Strike Global Offensive. So, this was just to show you how to play the game. Uh, in this case, we tested NVIDIA GeForce Now. It can be done with uh, pretty much any game. Uh, so, uh, I hope this was useful and uh, feel free to write, to comment if you have any questions or doubts or some issues that you had in the middle of this process. Um, and I hope to see you soon, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Bye! Hello. Hello.